recent social media post has sparked significant interest within the defense community after a user named 1ZZFET has shared a photograph showing a missile launcher vehicle at a roadside rest area in Japan. This vehicle, equipped with missile tubes, is believed to be part of Japan's hypervelocity gliding projectile, HVGP, system, a hypersonic weapon under development for the Japan Ground Self-Defense Force, JGSDF. Originally slated for deployment in 2029, the HVGP is now expected to enter service by 2026, reflecting Japan's accelerated efforts to address regional security concerns, particularly related to China and North Korea. Japan's decision to expedite the development of the HVGP highlights the shifting security dynamics in the region. China's increasing military assertiveness, combined with North Korea's advancing missile capabilities, has prompted Japan to enhance its strategic deterrence measures. The HVGP is part of a broader effort that includes seven domestic missile development programs, in addition to acquisitions of U.S.-made systems. This represents a significant shift in Japan's defense posture, which has traditionally focused on defensive measures and avoided precision strike capabilities since World War II. In July 2024, Japan's Acquisition, Technology and Logistics Agency, ATLA, revealed that it had successfully tested a hypersonic glide vehicle in California earlier in the year. These tests, conducted in March and April, marked the first known trials of the HVGP since its development began in 2015. A short video showcasing the missile's propulsion phase further fueled speculation and excitement about Japan's hypersonic weapon development. The HVGP is expected to provide Japan with unprecedented strategic deterrence due to its ability to glide at hypersonic speeds, evade missile defense systems, and strike targets with precision. The missile's ability to change trajectory mid-flight makes it exceptionally difficult for enemy defenses to intercept. With an estimated range of around 900 kilometers, the HVGP will serve as a powerful tool in Japan's evolving defense strategy. The HVGP will be deployed in two primary variants, Block 1 and Block 2. Block 1, the early deployment model, features a booster-assisted launch system and basic glide capabilities. Drawing from technology used in other Japanese missile systems, such as the Type 12 surface-to-ship missile, SSM, Block 1 is approximately 8 to 9 meters long. Block 2, the enhanced performance model, is a more advanced version, over 10 meters long, with a more powerful booster and sophisticated glide capabilities, allowing for extended range and possibly greater payload capacity. Both variants reflect Japan's commitment to near-term readiness and long-term capability enhancement. The HVGP is designed for island defense, a key priority for Japan as it seeks to protect its remote territories, particularly in contested areas like the East China Sea. The missile can be launched from mobile, ground-based platforms and glide over the sea to strike targets on enemy-controlled islands. Integration with Advanced Fire Control Systems FCCS, and the Global Navigation Satellite System GNSS, ensures high precision, making it a vital component of Japan's efforts to defend against potential invasions or military incursions. The system's versatility is further demonstrated by its compatibility with both land attack and maritime strike roles. Two types of warheads are currently under development, ensuring the HVGP can meet diverse operational needs in future conflicts. Japan's development of the HVGP marks a significant milestone in the country's defense capabilities. Early mass production began in 2023, enabling the accelerated deployment of the system by 2026. The enhanced versions of the HVGP are expected to extend their range to up to 3,000 kilometers by 2030, providing Japan with increased strike capabilities across greater distances. Tests conducted in California validated the missile's measurement systems and inertial navigation technology, ensuring that the HVGP meets stringent performance standards. Computer-generated images released by ATLA show the missile adjusting its altitude throughout its flight, showcasing its advanced maneuverability. Japan's decision to develop the HVGP and other hypersonic weapons reflects a broader shift in its defense policy. The country is increasingly focusing on developing offensive capabilities to address the growing military threats from neighboring countries. This strategic shift includes close collaboration with the United States, sharing vital technologies and resources to enhance missile development efforts. While Japan insists that its expanding missile capabilities are purely for defense and security, the rapid modernization of its military has raised concerns in the region about the potential for increased tensions. Nonetheless, Japan remains committed to bolstering its national defense in response to evolving geopolitical dynamics. The unveiling of Japan's hypervelocity gliding projectile system has generated significant interest, 
showcasing the country's accelerated efforts to develop hypersonic weapons. As Japan continues to enhance its missile capabilities and adapt to the shifting security environment, the HVGP stands as a testament to the nation's growing focus on strategic deterrence and precision strike capabilities. This ambitious development marks a key moment in Japan's defense modernization, signaling its readiness to confront emerging threats in the region.